All right, we are here with Roxanne Matafari. So far, thank you for taking the time to travel all the way down to Houston to get into a grappling match. I'm so excited. <laughs> Tell us about travel. Was, was it good travel? Are you easy to get down? Yeah, it was great. It was fine. Excellent. So I've noticed uh, you're on this tremendous trash talking run. Like it started with the, the Andrea Lee fight. Uh, and oh, now... it didn't just start with the Andrew Lee fight. I'm <laughs> and... trying really hard to promote the fight for all fights, you know, and I'm not a trash talker. I can't say right. mean things. So I just come across as super goofy, and so I'm running with that. It's the best, most uncomfortable trash talk I've ever seen. <laughs> it's like, you, your, your mom smells really nice because she <laughs> yeah. must take baths. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> so I've also noticed this uh, slight, another, is it a fascination with unicorns? What, what, what is the story just with unicorns? Just recently, um, you know, Mirakatsu, uh, okay. I'm sponsored by him. He, he gives me some rash guards and spats and stuff, and he just sent me his new new ones with rainbow unicorns like doing arm bars on each other, and I thought that was cool, and I wanted to promote his new clothes. Excellent. Um, so I, I took the opportunity. I just it just came to me like oh, I can call up Danielle Kelly and make this sound all aggressive <laughs> with my unicorn spats, and then they made that video and it exploded, and then yeah. ever since, you know, um, she commented like, oh, that's unicorny. <laughs> <laughs> which it is. It's a good comeback. Uh -huh. I mean. And she kind of went with it and yeah. I continued going with it. And, and then I found like a dollar wig. At, uh, <laughs> that was store. awesome. Yeah. Uh, tell us about how, how your journey, like how did you get started in jujitsu or MMA together? Like how That's you way started? too long a story. Give us, but... give us a short version of it. <laughs> but now I'm here, you know, I've been yeah. training for years, like 20 years I've been training. Wow. Um, I just love grappling. It's my favorite thing. Um, I love just the way you can make a part, make a, an opponent give up without injuring them ideally <laughs> but you can um it's beautiful it, the technique is just great you know females can beat a male yeah. you know, with technique and leverage so i think that's awesome you know one of the things with this card this is our first card on ufc fight pass uh, a portion of the proceeds from this card go to the rose center for breast cancer research one of the things I've noticed is that, like, I have two little girls, and even being around me their entire life, they're just not really interested in, in grappling. It's just kind of like, well, eh, they don't really, they think they're too weak for it. And I've heard from other, like, females as well on the outside looking in, like, who've never given it a shot. Like, they haven't tried to see, get in there and see just how strong they are. You know, what do you tell those ladies who you see not getting in and just trying it? Well, I mean, it's not for everybody, I think. Um, they're just not interested, but um, if, the reason is that they're intimidated or they think they're not strong it's not such a i mean it's a reason but um i would encourage them you know maybe try to train with other ladies because a lot of ladies are training now um and then to see what they can do think of it as well i i think it's fun so maybe they'll enjoy it usually people enjoy it when they try it right so i guess it's just getting past that initial uh, scary thing <laughs> where's the best place for our fans to go and learn more about you um, my social media, I'm usually uh, at Roxy Fighter on Twitter and Instagram. Is there anybody you'd like to thank? Yes, um, the people who helped me get ready for this, especially Guns uh, at Syndicate, um, my training partner Charlie, and Casey Milliken. Thank you. Well, it is, it, thank you for stopping and talking to me today, and it's an honor to have you as our, our main event this weekend. Thank you.